Hi, and welcome to this week's look at headlines in natural health on iHealthTube.com. Well, for decades, we've been told to limit our salt in order to improve our heart health. But now new research is showing that salt may not be that big of a deal after all. The research out of Canada shows that for most people, sodium consumption does not increase health risks, except for those who eat more than five grams or about two and a half teaspoons a day. And less than 5% of people in developed countries exceed that level. The study looked at 94,000 people aged 35 to 70 from 18 different countries for an average of eight years. It revealed the only risk of cardiovascular disease and strokes were where the average intake was greater than five grams a day. But any health risk from sodium was also virtually eliminated if people improved their diet by adding potassium-rich foods like fruits, vegetables, and beans. Well, a human stress hormone could be a factor in the onset of leukemia, a recent study has found. The research, done in England, found that leukemia cells evade the anti-cancer threats of the immune system by using the hormone cortisol. The study of the causes of acute myeloid leukemia found that those cancer cells use cortisol to force the release of a protein, which causes the secretion of another protein, galactin-9, which suppresses the body's natural anti-cancer immune process. The lead author said learning this pathway can help lead to new therapies that can use the body's natural immune system to help fight these cancer cells. Finally, despite nearly 70 million people around the world being affected by glaucoma, little has been known about the origin of the disease. But new research out of Massachusetts is indicating the eye disease might be an autoimmune condition. The study showed that the body's own T cells are responsible for the degeneration of the retina seen in glaucoma. Also, these T cells seem to attack retinal neurons after previous interactions with bacteria that normally lives in the body. Glaucoma damages the retinal and optic nerve and can lead to blindness, but the lead authors said this new information could help lead to new treatments for the disease. That's a look at what's making headlines in natural health this week. Make sure to go to iHealthTube.com, sign up for our free email newsletter so you stay connected to the latest information.